Hi peeps, welcome back to G's Corner. In today's corner, we are going to be spilling some tea. And yes, I am, my energy is so much getting back to its normal self. So I'm so glad to be making videos with you guys, for you guys. And if you have not turned that red button gray, please make sure you subscribe, hit the notification bell. Because if you do, you're going to get awesome videos. And also, you know, follow me on Twitter. Because if I'm not talking about it yet on YouTube, I'm definitely going to be chatting about it on Twitter so follow me on these corner and yes you guys everything is alleged on this channel alleged and the reason why I say everything is on alleged is basically because whatever I see that's tea related I make sure that it's alleged I don't put out false stuff okay I don't put out false stuff it, yeah I don't do all of that so let's just go ahead and say that so I had to you know let that be known because some people just think other things but anyways King Sid and Diamond Flawless now King Sid and Diamond Flawless I've been in my Twitter feed because you know I like to keep up with the latest and I'm like y'all this is this story here is just it's crazy so King Sid and Diamond Flawless actually dated a while back then they stopped dating for a while they dated other people and then they got back together or they was either on cool terms now, with that being said, even though they was on cool terms for well, just a little bit, something took a twist. Now, Diamond Flawless is known, you know, to have her meltdowns and everything. And, and a lot of people do care about Diamond Flawless' well-being. Sometimes she can be just a little bit out there with, you know, her meltdowns when she acts out. So, we pray that, you know, she doesn't get worse with this situation. Apparently, Diamond Flawless is saying that King City is broke. Allegedly, it also lives with his palm, and on top of that, he ain't. So, Diamond Flawless went live recently, and I have some of her clips, but I don't have like the full clip. One part of the live states that you know she asked him for a hundred dollars, and she and he said, Not sis, you ain't getting it. She got upset about it, but then on another part of the live, she talked about. You know, all good vibes only. So this is what the live said. Listen, guys, it's okay. Me and Jason are not it at all. He's not it. He won't even send me a hundred dollars because he's so broke. And me and Gio put you on. So yikes. For real, I am ignoring his existence, guys. It's okay. Me on my page no more. Just don't ask why I'm with. Him. Don't ask me about my exes. Just pretend that nigga died. Period. At Mod Monaleo, okay? Don't ask me about my ex. Period. Don't ask me who I'm with. Don't ask me what I'm with. Who I'm doing. You don't own me. I don't own you. So, period. Don't ask me who you with. No. So, we're only going to have positive vibes because everything I say ends up happening to me. So, I'm only going to say them be positive in the air. Like, I'm going to be on television. I'm going to be an actor, an actress. Like, positive vibes. Okay? Not negative. So, if you're negative, exit out. Press that exit right now and say, oh, I don't want to be here no more because you don't. We're gonna be too, so positive, you're gonna be sad. Thanks. So, y'all, I'm just mad about how she got this whole toothbrush out on public doing her ages with makeup. Okay. <laughs> I'm mad about it. But, you know, that's her. Okay. So, yes. um, She uh basically said what she said about King Sid. King Sid. <laughs> and I just wanna say, y'all, what do y'all actually think? about her comment and then what do you think about him supposed to be willing to give her a hundred dollars and apparently she asked for it and he didn't give it back but i have screenshots i have a screenshot i have some tea peeps of king c allegedly saying that he did give it to her okay or maybe it's this trolley what y'all think so here's the cash app apparently that was king seeds and he said you sent diamond flowers a hundred dollars i love it do you guys actually think, do you guys actually really think that D.D. actually sent her 100? Because why would she go online? I mean, I'm not saying, you know, a lot of people think Diamond Falls was going through some things. But why would she go online and say that? Like, why would she say that? Like, you didn't do this. You didn't do that. But you have a screenshot stating that apparently you did. I don't know. I, I don't get it. Help y'all understand. Make it make sense. Now, this comment I found under the shade room. Of course, y'all can see the shade room things and the logo in the background. Shout out to y'all. This comment says, folks still be making C reply. No, we not. LOL. She just read. She was just venting to me, being friendly every day. Then she got bad to me. She beefing with herself. 
So basically, the king says, skin said, said, it's all good on my end. I don't know what old girl doing, but she's doing it at her seven. And then he says, they one second I broke, then the other, she missed me. And then the other second, she missed me. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know what to say about the situation. I don't wish I still had, you know, King C's reaction. I think I don't know what happened to it, but if I can find it, I'll probably do my best to insert it in the video. Hold on. Let's see. Yeah, hold on. Let's see. So I couldn't find the teeth of King C's side. So you guys probably have not seen it by now. But yeah, he just basically saying that, you know, she capping. Basically. <laughs> But the next tea that we had to talk about on today's channel is definitely I was going to add it into my last video with um, my last previous video. But we got Chris Sales. Now Chris Sales has been kind of smooth lately. But Chris Sales wound up having another kid. So this is like the fourth one. But a lot of people kept telling people in the comment section, this ain't his, this ain't his, this ain't none of Chris's. So then turn to find out, you know, it is his, but... A lot of people are saying that Chris Sale's mom adopted the baby. But Chris Sale's mom came on and said, allegedly, no, so he's an adorable child that is so cute. But Chris Sale's is also adopted too, so it's kind of like in the family line. But we all know that Chris Sale's, you know, he does not sit there and deny his kids, or he makes sure he's a good father. He also makes sure he's present, no matter what the internet tries to say or do to Chris Sale's. So the the mother of Chris Sales actually posted this little confirm confirmation. She said, "I am the mother of six: Chris, Mercedes, Natty, Dwayne, Trinity, and David. I don't have any foster children." So just want to let y'all know the ones that's sitting here and saying, "Oh, she got this, she got that," and I see it's, she ain't got no other kids, but what the kids she got, and then the other kids that y'all saying could be her grandkids. Well, that is it for today's video, you guys. Thank you guys so, so much for watching. I hope that you guys enjoyed it. Make sure you hit that thumbs up button. And also, thank you guys for listening to this awesome tea. And make sure you hit that red button gray. Turn it gray because you're going to definitely be getting some uploads. And all, not only that, make sure you hit the subscribe button and notification bell. And follow me on Twitter. I got to go. Bye.